what's going on guys and welcome to another update this one is going to be for the 200,000 card collection i'm kind of bouncing back and forth between the two because i kind of need to clear out this space right here in the middle of the room so that i can make some more space uh, to be able to move around to bring stuff in so i'm um, kind of bouncing back and forth from the two uh, plus i came across something pretty amazing today i uh, did a little teaser video earlier tried out the youtube shorts didn't work out too well i'm gonna have to figure it out so that in the future i can do a little bit better of a short but uh, yeah, I wanted to say thank you to everybody. Today we hit 2,000 subscribers. Thank you guys so much for the support. I really appreciate everybody liking the videos, commenting, subscribing, or just watching the videos in general. I thank you so much for the support. I really appreciate it. So this box right here you saw in the teaser, it was full. Uh, I went through it. It was basically all rookies. So this stack right here is just a stack of rookies. Um, not too many notable ones in that stack, but um, it was all rookies. And they were all sleeved and they were all taken care of really well. Uh, right here, these are more notable players, star players. As you can see right there on the top, Derek Rose. So these are more notable players. And then if you come over here, I put some cards aside. To show you, here are the wild card cards from back in the day, but these are the more rare ones that have the numbers here on the bottom. The players are not too notable, but the cards itself are the rarer versions of the cards. I was looking for the Brett Favre, but unfortunately there was no Brett Favre. Oh, there's a Rich Gannon with a 10 on the bottom. There's a couple of those. I thought those were cool because those were sought out for back in the day. Here's some of the other cards I found in there. There's a Heinz Ward, Heinz Ward own the game. Uh, here's a couple of these crash cards that I had when I was growing up. Um, it was cool to find this. It was almost a full set of them. There's a Troy Aikman, a Steve Young, Dan Marino, John Elway. Joe Montana, Barry Sanders, Emmett Smith, there's a Jerry Rice, there's another one of those, Heinz Ward on the game, here's some of the rookies, uh, Darren McFadden, here's some of the, like, the more notable rookies that I found, there was a McFadden rookie, here's a, I thought this Elway card was really cool, um, back to school, Drew Bledsoe, Here's a back to school Jerry Rice and another one. And this is all just from one, this box here. Um, I didn't have a, really a chance to go through much more since the last video I uploaded. Here's a back to school again. Here's another Heinz Ward on the game. Uh, here's a rookie of Toby Gerhardt. Here's a rookie of Roddy White. Rookie Tory Smith. A rookie Alshon Jeffrey, rookie Malcolm Jenkins, and a rookie Kenny Britt. So yeah, these are not like super, super, super popular players, but definitely notable players uh, for when they were playing. Um, so yeah, I thought those were cool. And this all, this is all just from so all of this, all rookies, not too notable players. Here are some star players these more notable rookies and then this pile here uh these are the more uh bigger players bigger hits just from this box um like i said i haven't really had a chance to go through much of anything else since yesterday uh here is a gear uh sorry a grant hill rookie there's two of those here is a Ray Malaluga, rookie. Here's a second year Michael Vick. Here is an Allen Houston rookie. Here is a Matt Ryan rookie card. Very interesting to find that. Here is another Matt Ryan rookie. Here is his, in his college uniform. 
Some newer modern cards. Here's a Jordan Alvarez, Topps Chrome. Here is a Colin Kaepernick rookie. A Steve Nash rookie. A Chris Henry rookie. Emmanuel Sanders rookie. Von Miller rookie. Brian Cushing rookie. Funny thing about that is when I was in high school, um, my uncle coached Brian Cushing. Here is a black diamond, Kevin Garnett. Always fun to find Garnett's. Here is a Ray Allen black diamond. A black diamond, Kevin Garnett again. Here's a newer card, a rookie gold cup, Ryan Mountcastle. Here's some good ones, uh, Jason Kidd rookie. Here's another Jason Kidd rookie and a third Jason Kidd rookie. Here's another Gary Payton rookie. Here's a newer card. An Alec Bohm rookie, Tops Gold, uh, Tops Chrome. Here is a James Harden parallel for NBA hoops. A Kyrie Irvin parallel for NBA hoops. Very nice. Here is a Paul George, NBA Hoops, number to 89. Here is a Dominators, Justin Herbert. Very cool card. Now this card, bomb card. This is an NBA Hoops Slam Hollow. This is a Hollow, Allen Iverson. Look at that. Now, that is an awesome card. This most probably is my favorite card out of every one that I found in this, this box here. Insane card. Beautiful, beautiful card. Definitely going to be getting this one graded. Beautiful. And last but not least, the PSA card that I found earlier is a 2019 Panini Mosaic Rookie Zion Williamson Mint 9. There you go. I know a lot of people were guessing it. I guess you guys use the uh, the barcode there in the back or the number, the serial number. So I know, I know you guys were guessing it right before I made the video. So very good, very smart. I'm looking it up. I saw a lot of people said it was a, a rookie Jordan. I wish it was a rookie Jordan. Maybe one of these days I will be able to find a rookie Jordan in here. But this is not too bad to be able to find in here. So yeah, I'm a couple of update videos into this collection and I feel like we're doing pretty good. And I have a ton more to go through. So just imagine all of this that I just showed you right now is from just one box. So, you know, the possibilities are endless. These are more like sets over here, but the possibilities are endless on what could possibly be in there if this is what's in just one box. So I'm gonna continue going through all of this and I'm gonna share with you whatever I find. Um, I've been posting, you know, I've been trying to post every other day or every two days. I Sometimes I post, you know, back to back days. Um, I'm trying to, uh, you know, just share with you uh, everything I find along my journey of going through these collections, like I said in my my first video or one of my first videos, you know I've been buying collections now for for a couple of months, almost a year, um, and uh, you know I never thought to share my journey with everybody. Uh, I was finding some really great stuff, and you know I just wanted to. I decided one day I wanted to share with everybody. I thought it would be pretty cool to uh, to take everyone on my journey um, and and make them a part of it. And share with you guys what I find. So I'm glad you guys are enjoying the content. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe to the channel. I have so much more 
like so much more. I have over a half a million, maybe 700,000 cards still to go through in the 1 million card collection. I have still so much more left in this collection and I'm constantly looking for more collections. I'm talking to people right now currently about other collections that I could possibly score. So please subscribe to the channel if you would like to stay updated with videos. If you like this video, smash the thumbs up button. And if you'd like to leave a comment, leave a comment below, it really helps out. Once again, thank you guys for watching and I will catch you in the next one.